<laughs> as I said, um, this protection order, yeah, it does not pass the reasonable consumer test. <laughs> Thinking of a consumer, right, <laughs> purchasing one of these protection orders, yes, without their signature, yeah, that doesn't look anything like the protection orders that are issued in every city of the United States. Doesn't look anything like them. None of those protection orders should have any forgeries on them. <laughs> None of them should have it be issued for 10 years without the signature of the petitioner. Now, this disillusion of marriage where, at times, the police or sheriff's departments have to serve the respondent. Yes. When it says mail returned unclaimed and I don't have a copy of it and I can't show it to law enforcement and say, well, this is the actual disillusion of marriage that was served on me. Does this look like anything that you've served as a police department or sheriff's department? No. See, I don't even have a copy of it that I could show them in each and every city and every county of the United States. Now, let's say you're sitting there as a sheriff. And uh, my wife says, well, we're still married. And you call me and you say, Paul, yes, can I see a copy of your disillusion of marriage? I've never served. I was never served. Uh huh. See, it doesn't look like anything that they've seen before. Yes. See, this first restraint provision uh -huh, on page one. Ouch. This is page four of six. Mm -hmm. It says the respondent didn't receive actual notice because there's no X in the box. Yes. See, they have that there so that when you fill this out. Yes. You can say that I received actual notice, but I didn't receive actual notice. Yes. I couldn't be a, 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 a credible threat, could I now? <laughs> the petitioner didn't think so. She didn't sign it. <laughs> she didn't appear in court. She didn't want it. <laughs> now, this idea of intimate partner, as in we had had sex. Yes. I have five sons as proof of the actual intimacy of the relationship. <laughs> the problem is I don't have a copy of the disillusion of marriage that I could show any sheriff, <laughs> any police officer, and any police department of the United States because you never obligated her to serve me after you issued the disillusion of marriage. <laughs> now, for all of you in law enforcement that you think about what you do every day, pooch, I would say that there shouldn't be any police officer employed in any city that they didn't spend a certain amount of time serving protection orders, yes, or disillusions of marriage. <laughs>